The ethical challenges we face in organizations today are complex and pervasive, involving individuals in a personal and private way, or involving groups of people or even our entire organization. Sometimes we cannot solve these challenges on our own. In an effort to equip all stakeholders to face these challenges and deal with them effectively, the Ethics Institute presents our video-based ethics learning program, Business Ethics, Everyone's Responsibility. If you think about what an organization is, uh, it's really a network of relationships. And to get any organization to work, you need to make sure that you get the collaboration of everyone in that network. And the way of getting that is by treating people in an honest way, in a fair way, and, and with respect. And the moment that that does not happen, the relationship starts breaking down and the organization can't function optimally. Um, there's also a big uh, correlation between how you treat people and the morale of any organization. Now, if we talk about morale, we talk about the dedication of people to the organization and also the effort that they're willing to put into their work. And the moment that you treat people well, you raise the morale and therefore we see that ethical organizations are normally high morale organizations and therefore high performing, performing organizations. And in that sense, uh, ethics is, is, is absolutely core to running a successful organization. This program is designed to provide you with the knowledge and tools to consider ethical challenges and begin to answer them in ways that are honest, rational and competent. The program is presented in three modules. In Module 1, you will acquire an ethics vocabulary and learn to apply your mind to and communicate effectively on ethics. In Module 2, you will learn the importance of ethics for organizations and why organizations invest in ethics programs. In the final module, you will gain clarity on your role in respecting and upholding your ethical standards and a clear understanding of what your organization requires of you in terms of ethical behavior. People are not um, infallible often will make mistakes but people trust you if they know that when you make a mistake you'll own up to it and you'll fix it. How do we navigate through the ethical dilemmas? Because if you if you don't talk about it and you almost don't get people to role play around it, when it happens you people don't know what to do um, or they don't recognize it for what it is. We always hear the phrase walk the talk, yeah? But walk the talk is an easy phrase, but it, 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 it means a lot. It means how you behave, share your experience. Even if you have done something bad before and paid for it, mm. share that. Mm. Share that with younger people, because that's the way they will learn. Um, so it, it, it means every single day you have to eat, sleep, live ethics. You have to talk about it openly, and you have to be actually brave enough to tell people one of the most important things that one can do to build the ethical culture is to focus on what you want. We so often find that organizations focus on what they don't want and they talk about all the things that they have zero tolerance for. But to focus on what you really want, the type of values, the type of behaviors that you want to see, uh, that is really the way to change a culture and to reinforce a culture. And <coughs> One important aspect of that approach is to start catching those people who do right. We so often focus on catching the people who do wrong that we forget that it's much more powerful to focus on those people who are really exemplars of what we want and to give these people recognition. As you apply your learning in your working environment, you can strengthen your ethical culture throughout your organization, making it easier for everyone to live dignified, professional lives.